Hello everybody, today I decided to make a more detailed location guide for Quattro Colinas because in my opinion it is the best place to hunt red deer and with the Truax red deer coming soon I know a lot of you might be wondering where you need to hunt them. But before we get into the video I would like to remind everyone to like, share, subscribe and hit that bell icon to never miss an upload. Also I stream on Twitch 5 days a week if you would like to receive notifications for when I go live or post a video as well as talk about anything Call of the Wild be sure to join my Discord, the links to all those will be down below. But without further ado, let's get into today's video. So this location right here is going to be the first one we cover today. It is up at the top right of the map. You've probably seen this one in about every other Red Deer video on Quattro Colinas because it is just such a good spot. Almost all, actually literally all of these drinking spots right here can have Red Deer. We actually have one right here, but they literally spawn around this entire lake. If we fast travel over to here, you will see that there is a just ton of zones. We got another level 6 red deer right there. If you look over in this direction, we've got usually some drinking on this hillside. Yep, there's one right there. And I'm not going to run over, but there is red deer that drink here, red deer that drink there, there, there. So there's just a ton of red deer around this lake. In particular, this one up here is also super good, and we will actually check that out next. Now, I don't have any in this particular spot right now, but this is a good red deer spot. As you can see, I've got a zone here. They just are not at it because of some wolves, but they do drink there. Uh, they drink across, directly across from us, but I don't know where they are oh that explains it there's wolves but yeah there's zones there there is a zone over here in fact i just saw a herd of red deer when i was looking over here a few minutes ago so we will see if we can find them there they are as you can see we got more red deer right over here around this zone i have seen them right here also I'm not sure if they're there at the moment, though. I'm assuming that these ones also got spooked off by the wolf pack. Because this area does have a decent amount of wolves, too. Which, that is another awesome thing about these zones. Is there's tons of wolves up here to hunt, also. So, you're not only getting red deer, but you're getting wolves, you're getting roe deer, you're getting mouflon at this lake over here. But I don't think mouflon are over here, but they are at... The lake over here on the right. The next location is one that you will have to put a tent to if you want to get here quick. It is right below the lake at the top right. This is also a very good lake. It has three red deer zones I believe which are right here on the map. And as you can see we have red deer. Where did he go? I just saw him. There he is. There is a red deer there. There is another red deer there with a bunch of females. There's also roe deer and wolves, mouflon, I believe some ibex too. Uh, there's none over here at the moment, but there is another red deer spot that's just on this bank. So you will want to check that. Really this entire lake can have red deer around it, so it is probably one of the best spots that is not the uh, top two. If you've already hunted these, you're probably going to want to come down here next. Now, the next location is actually right below that lake, too. This one isn't as good, but it does have a couple spots that you can look for red deer. Now, the places that I usually find red deer here is they sometimes are right on this little hillside. Uh, I th is that an albino? Uh, we're going to have to go ahead and kill that. <laughs> I think that's an albino. It is. Yeah, that's an albino. Um, looks like we're going to be putting our red deer guide on hold. To get that one down. <laughs> um, that was unexpected, but I'm happy with that. I will take an albino any day. <laughs> but uh, as I was saying before we got interrupted by the albino... Red deer can drink right here. Uh, right now there's just a roe deer there. But in these trees you will find red deer. 
And then right around where the wolf was, you will find red deer. I believe they can also be over on this side, but I have not been able to confirm that because I don't hunt that side often enough. But I would imagine that if you can find them on this side, there's probably a possibility of getting them to spawn on the other side. Well, that was a nice little surprise, finding an albino wolf while we are making a red deer guide. That I did not expect, but I will take that any day. We needed a good one for our multi-mount anyway. There it is, female albino. Not uh, as big as I was hoping for, but that is really cool to find, especially since we were not even looking for them. So that's going to be a nice little addition to our mount. Now, the next spot is actually right here, and this is the spot that I've killed both of my level 9 red deer with the big rack in the past couple weeks, so I can confirm that it is a very good spot. I cannot promise that you will have the same luck as me, but it is a very good spot to check, nonetheless. They can drink right on this corner right here. There's none there at the moment, it looks like. Uh, I might have spooked them when I spawned in, because I did have to replace that tent, so it might be a little bit too close. But they drink on this side of the shore, they drink on the opposite side of the shore, they drink in between. So you'll find zones for them right here, right here. I don't have one here at the moment. Uh, I don't think you can get them on this side, but these three spots, you can find them. And this one at the end has produced both of my big rack level 9s. So I would check that spot especially. But it doesn't look like anything's here at the moment. So we will move on to the next spot, which is actually these two lakes right here. They are about smack in the center of the map. And they are pretty good. As you can see, we have some red deer right there, and that is a level 2. <laughs> I was actually looking for one of these the other day when I was doing my... Uh, getting every rack before true racks, and I could not find one, so I ended up just using the one that I had killed previously. But, um, <laughs> there's one of them. Of course they come out when I am not looking for them. But as you can see, there's a ton of mouflon around here too, along with roe deer. And I believe at the ibex drinks times, you can find some ibex here too. But there's quite a few animals around this lake. Uh, this one's not as good, but it also has red deer zones, so you will want to check it. I like to have a tent on both of them, just to save time, but if you don't have the extra cash to be buying a bunch of tents, just place a tent kind of in between them, and it will be pretty much just as good. There is our red deer. I'm pretty sure this is the only zone for them. Uh, I haven't seen them on this side of the lake. They're really only on the left side, and sometimes kind of in the middle, but that could just be from the same drink zone, because they do drink in slightly different areas at different times. But yeah, they drink on that little corner over there. Now, the next spot is here in the bottom right corner, and this one is very good. It's got, I believe, four or five different drink zones for red deer, and most of them you can see from here. Uh, we got another wolf, and that explains why there's no red deer, but they drink right here on this spot. They drink right here, right here, right here. But I don't think we're going to see anything because of that wolf. But yeah, all of those spots that I just showed can have red deer. So this is a good lake to check also. I'm not going to go through this entire lake because it would take quite a while to get around it. So the next one is going to be this lake down here. Uh, you can spawn at this lodge, but I like to have a tent on this side so I can get to these zones a little quicker. From what I've seen, there is red deer over here and over here, but it's been a long time since I've hunted here, so I cannot confirm that at the moment. Uh, there's nothing at this lake from what I remember. Um, this one can have red deer right on this shore, but I believe that's the only spot that I've seen red deer on this particular lake. We will go have a quick look at it, though, and see what is going on. Uh, there is no red deer here at the 
moment, but there is a roe deer, so I guess there's also a roe deer zone here. A lot of roe deer around here, actually. But yeah, that's, that is the only red deer spot on this lake from what I know. I could be wrong, there might be more. Oh, actually, in fact, there is. Just as I'm saying that, I hover over another one. So there is two red deer zones, actually. Now, one thing I would like to say is right here on the river. I have got a warning call from them before, but I was never able to find the zone. And the next time I went there, there was nothing there. So there could be a red deer zone on the river here, but I wouldn't spend too much time trying to find that one. It doesn't really seem worth it. Uh, the next place that we can go is this lake right here. It doesn't have a lot of zones. I think it's only got one. But I've killed some decent ones here. And there's a lot of other stuff here also. It's not just red deer. There's roe deer. There's ibex. There's mouflon. There's wolves. There's rabbits. You name it, it's here. This is one of those all-purpose lakes. There they are. So that is one of the red deer spots. I don't believe this is the only one. This is actually one I've never seen before. Alright, well, I do not see any more red deer around here, so I guess this is where the zone is. Uh, I'm assuming they've moved it since the last time I found them here, because I remember it being a little bit closer over here. But with every patch, they tend to move them around a little bit, so this could just be where they moved it to. But yeah, there's red deer right here. And I think that pretty much does it for the guide. There's not really any other locations that have them. Given I have not explored these lakes too much, but I've never heard of anybody killing red deer over here, so I would not even waste your time with those. But I hope everybody enjoyed the guide. I just wanted to give a little more updated location guide on Quattro because I feel like it's going to be one of the best maps to hunt for the True Rack Red Deer when they release. It has like the best places to go to. You can get a lot of red deer in a very short amount of time just going between these two lakes alone. So I feel like I really feel like it will be the place to go when True Rack Red Deer come out. But I hope everybody enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to leave a comment. Let me know what you liked about it. If you are interested in finding out what calibers and gear to use, I have another Red Deer guide that I posted a few weeks ago. We will put it in one of the end cards for everybody to see if you are interested in that. But thanks for watching, my dudes. Peace.